Hello, to set up your Typo C120 camera, first of all you have to go into your Play Store and search for the Typo application and download yourself TP-Link Typo. As you do it, you simply have to go in and right here, if you're doing it for the first time, you have to create a TP-Link ID, just like this. You have to select your location and your email. The registration process is pretty quick and simple, it takes about one minute or maybe two minutes and after that after you are registered you have to simply log in so I already have the account so let me quickly log in all right we are logged in and right now you have to add devices so right here we have the uh, all devices category and the button add, dev add devices but in case you cannot see it go into cameras right here and select add devices Right here we have the list of all available and compatible cameras to uh, connect with your application. Um, here we have Typo C120 camera, which is our camera, but before we select it, or already we can select this camera. And as you can see, here is the information to securely connect power connector. So let's do it. At the back of the camera right here, there is a Type-C port uh, for the power uh, for the camera and it is recommended to use the dedicated Type-C cable which is included with the camera um, and so use the dedicated cable I will use my uh, different Type-C cable and if you connect the cable to the camera be sure to when you connect it to push it so the connector will be sitting there tightly because right here is the rubber sealing to prevent this um, to prevent any water and dust from coming uh, into the port so be sure to when you connect the cable be sure to like push it so it sits nice and tight all right now as we turn on the camera there is the right led uh, appearing which basically means that the camera is starting up and next there is the red and green uh, lights blinking so let's see that means that the camera is ready to connect so now we see the red and green lights let's select next and right now we have to connect to the camera's hotspot uh, so let's go into the Wi-Fi settings right now all right and now as you can see we have the typo cam let's connect to it as we are connected the device and the, the software the application and the camera connects and now you have to connect the camera with your Wi-Fi so let me quickly connect it to the Wi-Fi now the camera just said that it is connecting to the Wi-Fi Wi-Fi connected it's connected the LED indicator turned, turned uh, the, into the amber color, which basically means that the camera connected to the Wi-Fi. All right, the connection, it took quite some time. Right now we can change the name of our camera. For example, simply just camera. Next, and right now we have to select at which place the camera is um, placed, where it is located. So here we have custom locations and some already presets let's for example i don't know select that the camera is in the office next we can change the icon of the camera let's select the couch uh, icon and just like that we have the camera connected it is all set up here we have the information in, about the typo care cloud services uh, it basically gives you unlimited cloud storage and Rich notifications and smart sort and um, here we have some information from the Q&A uh, we will not actually get the plan so let's skip it also you can uh, insert SD card into your camera and the SD camera sl SD card slot is located on the right side of the camera under this uh, rubber rubber um, ceiling the port is right here so let me quickly show you how to insert the camera inside um, 
with the camera facing upwards with the face with the lenses facing upwards you have to take your SD card and also make sure that the pins are facing upwards and just like that you have to insert this camera right here and push it until you feel a click just like that but I will remove this the SD card is not formatted please format it according to the app guidelines as you just heard I removed it to prevent from this communica communication from this notification but the card is not formatted so you before you insert your SD card you have to format it or you can also do this in the application all right and just like that the camera is all set up right here as we go into cameras right here we have the peer review of this camera we can watch the peer review as you can see uh, we can press manage but right here we have a bunch of options we can record the recording actually record the video we can take a picture we can uh, set cameras microphone uh, microphone sensitivity we can actually call the camera so we can talk with the with someone who's in the room currently uh, we can also just simply talk not call but just talk to someone um, we can turn on light but oh, as you can see here is the lightning uh, here's the function tag on and this basically means that when you see when the camera sees a person or a cat for example or any other animal it will like put a square on this on the person or, or on the animal and it will like recognize that if it's an animal or if it's a human or for example also a ve vehicle or as you can see here is here it is uh, tagging something like this my camera right here um, so basically that's that's all about setting up the application the camera um, thank you for watching and please subscribe